Hello my friends, welcome back to my channel and today we're doing Casa Ole. Now, I looked on YouTube, I hadn't seen anybody do a mukbang of Casa Ole, so I may be the first one. So, they're delicious Tex-Mex um, food and um, so I have some of their famous green sauce and some chips. Mm -hmm. mm. Oh god. And I have um, a chimichanga and I have some avocado. And I have um, three chicken enchiladas beans and rice. Mm. It's been, oh my god, years since I've been over here. Because with the pandemic. Mm. I thought I ordered the white sauce. Oh well, they're still gone. Because I really like their white sauce. First time I ordered through DoorDash. It's kind of complicated. Um, I wanted to order a couple of just hard tacos, and I couldn't find no tacos on there. They don't do tacos on DoorDash. Oh. Well. I got the famous green dip. Hmm. I should have put more in my date on my bowl, maybe. Hmm. Let me try their beans. love their beans. Oh, I have missed their beans. They have the best refried beans. This taco casserole used to be my great aunt Thelma's favorite place to eat. And she came to Brian. And on the morning news show, they have where you send in their picture, and at the end of the show, they draw for the day of her birthdays. She'd always win, always win. And back then, it'd be you go to the mall, to the with the candle store, and you could pick out. I think it was like six votive candles. So we'd always go over to Castle Ole and. Uh, We'd eat there first, and then we'd go to the mom to get her um, wood of candles. Boy, it'd be so funny. She'd go in there, and she'd break wind. <laughs> she goes, it's the best place to break wind because you won't be able to smell it. <laughs> you know? Too long after that, the candle store burned in the mall, and they didn't rebuild. So, mm. I, Jimmy Chong I don't know what it was. They had a wet burrito, and I don't know. They're all. I swear they were the same thing. Why don't you just say, "Hey, I want." What kind of whatever in the middle? I got ground meat. It was cheaper. It 
because I had to pay for the whole family and it was a hundred dollars I was like well I guess it's not that bad nowadays because I'm just driving through getting chicken fifty sixty dollars A big um, enchilada. Yeah, I like my chicken enchiladas, but I know I picked that white gravy. This is alright. Very sweet. because I went to Sam's picked up my grocery order. They're locked out of the bedroom. Just pouring this with me. They didn't come in here in time. Darty ate. Rum. I bought three cases of water and my other stuff I needed at Sam's. Mother grocery items. And that little guy. He just threw my stuff all in my van. He just threw it in the whole car with just shaking. Oh, what in the hell? I kept looking at him. He just kept throwing stuff. Just throwing stuff. So I told him after he left, I told my son, I said, Go back there and make sure he didn't crush my eggs. Cause that's one thing I said, I'll just, instead of getting them at Walmart yesterday, I'll just get them at Sam's. And he goes back there, he goes, there is no eggs. So I look at my order and it says, They were out of them. I was like, well, you know, I know Sam has other eggs. If you do like one more, say, hey, do you want the substitution? Which they didn't. And I was like, well, thank goodness I have a few eggs. But that means I still ha I'm gonna have to go back to the Walmart sometime to get eggs. Atticus, he does that. It's just a front uh, against the door. Well, I went to get some of that expensive gas today. Fifty-eight seventy-one for half tank gas. Yes. 
My son says he fills up his Ram truck for ninety dollars, almost on empty. And I was like, well, if I'm paying almost sixty dollars for half a tank, that's a hundred twenty dollars for a full tank. When I used to fill up my whole van for like thirty four dollars. That's just ridiculous. Boom. That's one reason I joined this DoorDash. You just pay that $9.99. Well, the first month says it's free. So I get a month free. And then they start charging $9.99. For delivery, that's a good, that's a good deal. My guess is, no, my luck they'll go up on that. They make the best free fried beans. I want to tell you. Look at that. That's just delicious. So, I'm hoping to do a lot more different mukbangs than everybody else. Because it seems like most people do the same stuff over and over and over and over and over. I'm still going to cook at home, too. But it seems like most everybody does McDonald's, Burger King, what else do we talk about? That's about all. I don't even ever see. They don't do it in many places. You don't ever see anybody going to like the Wiener Schnitzel and um, let me see. Arby's every once in a while. I love Arby's. You know, that's my favorite restaurant. Best food. Um, fried chicken. People don't do too much Wendy's because Wendy's is disgusting. I've never eaten their hamburgers. Maybe they're good. I've eaten their chicken nuggets. They were disgusting. I remember hearing Lord a long time ago when Oprah was still on this had been the 90s. She had Sharon. Sharon was saying that she loved to go to um, Wendy's after her concert or whatever. And she'd get a baked potato and some, uh, a bowl of chili. Well, it's like I took myself the next day, went over there. Got me a big potato that was black as can be. It was rotted. And the chili was just water and grease. I guess don't listen to slubbers. I love Dolly Parton, but I tell you, that Taco Bell pizza. Maybe Taco Bell makes it different for celebrities, and you know if they're gonna sponsor them or whatever. Because um, I'm tell you what, fresh regular folks, that stuff's nasty. I 
a commercial for this local restaurant in town. Of this chili cheese. Is it just chili and cheese on a bun? Looks like a three year old made it on the commercial. I said, like, if that's the way it looks like on the commercial, I hate to see what it looks like when you get it. Because that looks like when you go to when you go to some hamburger place and you think it's going to look pretty, that's how it really comes out with like a three year old made it. Maybe it looks good when you get there. I don't know. Yeah, these are good enchiladas, but they sure would be a whole lot better. A piece of chicken. I think it's called um, sour cream sauce or something. This ain't what they put on gaming. I see, I ordered three, three of them. There's one. It may be three. Yeah, it took me several days to finally decide. So, I don't want to. Join Bro Dash. Mm. I'm actually lost. I may have to wait until later. I am so full. Shit, Castle stop me. I went, I have a friend I went to school with. She now lives in Arkansas. She'll come back to Texas just to eat at Castle Lane. She came back, I think it was last year. I wanted to see her, what, what happened? Something happened. I was sick or something. I don't know. I think it's when everything was starting to open back up. And I didn't feel too safe about it, still wanting not to eat. Mm. I got some sauce left. I'm gonna have to get me some more chips. I'll have to save that for later. It's early. It's only five o'clock here. And that's the rest of my enchiladas. I'm gonna have to go back and check. I'm gonna order because I'm. I know I picked white sauce for that. Because my youngest son Ashton, he got um ordered him a chicken enchilada, a beef enchilada, and a cheese enchilada. And they're supposed to all have different sauces, and we can tell whose was whose because um it all looked the same. So. It was delicious. Yeah. And I want to thank all my new subscribers. I've got some more. 
And hopefully I'm gonna get some more for doing different mukbangs, bangs, bongs. Depends some where you're coming from. What part of the country you're from. Everybody calls it different from wherever they're at, whatever. I just call it stuff in your face on camera. <laughs> and if you're returning, welcome back. And I'm Joan. So remember to click the subscribe button. I know a lot of y'all are watching my videos and y'all are not clicking the subscribe. It doesn't hurt. Just click the subscribe. It doesn't hurt at all. It's free and it does not hurt. Every YouTube video I watch, I always subscribe to them. If you don't watch them for a couple of them, you, you won't even see them. So I don't know if you want to see me again, but it helps me out. If you please subscribe and click the like button and the bell notification and leave a comment if you like and I will see you in the next video. Bye bye.